I will go back to 2009 when I first came to the school. Um, during that time, I thought it was very important that the school have a clear direction and uh, we conducted a lot of surveys um, to, to really get the information about where the school was at and where we wanted the school to be and what we needed to do to get there. The information coming back from um, all, all areas of the school, parents, teachers and students, was really that they uh, needed support in understanding what, what university life was like, what TAFE was like. They really didn't know what they had to do to get to these post-school um, uh, you know, opportunities or options. And um, the thing that, that actually came out was that the parents were saying uh, to me that um, they didn't have confidence in coming into the school because of their own language. Um, we then allocated resources to uh, employ an international student coordinator who speaks Mandarin. And um, the students immediately you could see that they felt very comfortable uh, with that, the students that speak Mandarin. Mm. And uh, we also employed uh, an Arabic community liaison person. And um, Nazak immediately connected with the families, immediately got all of their uh, contact details and, um, and she's continually uh, exchanging information. Um, with this, I think the follow-up was the students immediately saw that the school was really trying to connect with them and connect with their families. And um, uh, the teachers also, when they had an issue, it, was, it could be easily resolved. Um, the communication in the school just improved and I believe the relationship with the, the, the school improved. So immediately when we started talking about different pathways, um, the, the parents all, all of a sudden were listening and um, we were talking about university and uh, we then organised with the, the university to uh, come out and, um, and meet with our parents. They spoke at PNC meetings, um, also at subject selection evenings. They set up um, an evening at the university. We provided a bus and the parents and the students all went into the university and they were working together so it was a real partnership. The students frequently um, would come up with ideas themselves. We've introduced learning conferences and uh, we have these every year now because they've been so successful. And during those learning conferences, the students are given skills that they'll need to transition into the senior school, but they're also given um, opportunities to say how they're learning in the school um, could be improved. And it's really a direct result of what the students and parents were saying um, that uh, we've identified a number of specific groups to support.